Hi guys, welcome to my new YouTube video. This is a different kind of video than I usually post, a video with a voiceover and a detailed, well I hope, um, explanation how to draw an eyebrow and lashes. In my next video I divided them in two, otherwise it will be too long. So this is the finished result. I finished the left eyebrow and lashes. Um, added a little bit of glitter on the eyelid uh, just to create this uh, sparkle effect. For those who don't know her, uh, let me introduce this beauty. This is the Rebel Beauty, one of the 10 beauties I designed for NYX Cosmetics, which are free to download on their official website and mine as well. So let's start it. This is one of the many ways you can uh, draw an eyebrow. But I think for those who has uh, difficulties with eyebrows, it is the good start. So to create a uh, stencil, you need one sheet of transparent paper. Now take a ruler and a pencil. So I start to draw a line from the outer corner of the eye up and from the uh, beginning of the eye up. Alright, so we are drawing basically a box around the eye and now I am uh, repeating the line which all templates has like a guideline for the eyebrow and I'm making it more visible. So this is also the reason why I like to sketch on the, uh, on the transparent paper because uh, you can see if the eyebrow suits the uh, face shape and if it uh, suits the total look uh, you uh, want to create and it just um, you will not ruin the face chart. Now draw another line and it should look like this. So one more time, so from the outer corner of the eye up and from the beginning of the eye up and the connecting line. So next step is to divide this line in three equal parts. Alright, so this point will be our highest point of the eyebrow, the arch. So from this point I'm drawing a line up. So now I have to determine how thick my eyebrow will be. Alright, um, it's up to you what kind of the eyebrow you want to uh, create, uh, style or thickness. But in this case, I need to repeat the same eyebrow I already drew uh, on the right side. So thickness of the eyebrow will be the same from the arch to the beginning of the eyebrow, but from the arch to the tail, we're just connecting the points. Now connect these two lines with a half a circle, like this. So here you have it, you have the shape of the eyebrow. So now we are going to create our stencil, we're going to cut the shape. Uh, I have like a craft knife, but you can also use the scissors, just make sure you will uh, not cut your fingers.
When our stencil is ready, just put it back on the face chart and make sure that lines are matching. So the uh, line of the template, the guideline, should match the lower line of the uh, stencil. And now I'm going to take the contour palette uh, from NYX. And you're going to need a cotton round. And I'm going to use this color. And basically you need to decide earlier what color of eyebrows you want to create. Um, but in this case, again, I want to repeat the eyebrow on the right side. So I'm going to use the same color I used uh, for the brow on the right side. And now you just push it into the paper just fill the uh, space and now this is the result that you created so basically you created the background for the hair strokes so just to make sure that you will not make mistakes you can use pencil uh, to uh, sketch your stroke first so what I'm doing now, I'm um, sketching the line. This is the line where hairs will come together. So it, this is basically the same when you style your own eyebrow and you're using like a spoolie and the hairs just come together in a certain point, it depends how your eyebrow is growing. And of course, in this case, I'm just repeating the same style I already um, created on the right side. So now I'm taking a piece of transparent paper. Um, this is to make sure that I'm not smudging anything from the face shirt and just to keep the area clean. With a black fine liner, I'm starting to draw uh, hair strokes uh, by following guidelines I already created with a pencil. So in this case, I try to copy uh, the eyebrow that I already have on the right side. Uh, but personally, I'm always uh, drawing the both eyebrow at once. Uh, yes, but this uh, in this case I had already uh, one eyebrow, so I'm trying to copy the same style. So you see when you do um, the strokes first with the pencil is quite handy and um, I, I think uh, it's quite difficult to ruin the eyebrow when you uh, make a sketch first. 
Unfortunately, I am covering the view with my hand, um, but I am following the guidelines I already uh, did with the pencil. So you just keep adding strokes and make sure that eyebrow on the left side look like the eyebrow on the right side. Um, what about the style of the eyebrow? So um, where to get the inspiration from? So what I do, I always um, look in the mirror, you know, you can style your own eyebrow, you can just take a spoolie and brush your, um, your eyebrow and to look how the hair is growing. So you can look directly in the mirror and try to copy your own eyebrow. And there are so many uh, beautiful pictures on Instagram and on the internet that you can take as, an, as inspiration and uh, try to draw, draw the eyebrows from the picture if you wish. So next thing what I'm going to do is uh, to take the stencil place again on the face shirt and I'm taking uh, a darker shade. Uh, I want to create a dimension, so I'm placing the darker shade from the arch to the tail. And this is the result that we have. So with uh, the eraser pencil I'm creating the highlights, like on the shiny strokes with uh, by erasing um, some parts like that so now with the brush I'm going to soften the edges and also to make sure that the eyebrow on the left side uh, looks like the eyebrow on the right side as much as possible. So now I'm adding some strokes with the fine liner. Uh, as finishing touch and just to make sure that I'm satisfied with the eyebrow to go on with uh, eyelashes and eyeshadow uh, to finish the whole look so we are finished for now um, I hope it was helpful uh, if you liked it come back for the second part and thank you so much for watching